not scouting talk happy new year to all of our subscribers and viewers to celebrate the end of the decade what we thought we'd do is rank a selection a random selection of knots players um into five categories embarrassing terrible average good and club legend as you can see i think you'd go in the uh club legend slot well already you said it <laughs> right let's kick off let's go mike edwards club legend Club legend, you've got to put Mike Edwards in that club legend spot. Yeah, I remember him. Like, just, just club legend. You don't need to say much more about Mike Edwards. I take him at centre back for the next, still for the next ten years. Solid. That's that's a huge shame. National League standard. <laughs> he's a fitness coach, though, isn't he? So he's got the fitness. Yeah, the fitness coach. Is it Man is that? Now? I don't know. Pretty sure. I don't have a clue. Yeah, I, I hope do. not. Right, Kane Hemmings. <sighs> hmm. Tough season he had, didn't he? But he was the top scorer in a very bad team. Mm. There's t for me, it's out of average and good. Yeah, and no, I agree. He's definitely not a club legend. Did, didn't he? he score 14 goals, though, in a team that went down? Yeah. But Christian Dennis scored like 20 something, didn't he, in Chesterfield's team that went down? Mm. Oh, I'm going to go. We've got to agree on it. I'm going to go average. I'm going to put him in average. Do you know why? Because you, when he came in, yeah, like I was like buzzing. Like fair enough, he didn't have the team to to supply him and everything like that. But he was one of those players for me. Unless it was happening, he didn't make it happen. No, he he, he just wanted it to happen for him. Average. I mean, he's got a lot of goals. <clears throat> so uh, yeah, we'll put Hemmings in average, right? Jack Grealish. Yeah, he's, he's up there, isn't he? He's not a club I, legend. He's not a club legend. He's he's yeah, he's, he's just, in he's, good. He's in good. Like look what he's gone on to achieve now. He's our one of like, basically our best player. He's seventeen. So it says it all, doesn't it? Yeah, his socks so low. Yeah, so low. So you've got to put him in good. Jack Grealish goes into good. I, might, I, I don't know when when he first started playing for Notts. Could you imagine how good he'd be now? He probably could actually. It was class. I don't know because you you never. And now he's captain of Villa in the Prem. Like, you never, especially at Notts, never seem, we never seem to loan any players. And ended up being like world be it for the, the team in the Prem. You know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. So. We'll, we'll, yeah, we'll put Grealish in good, not quite club legend standard. No. Sivard Sprockle. <laughs> <laughs> the man ran like an oil tanker, didn't he? Like, oh my gosh. I'm going to kick it straight off. I'm putting Sprockle. His guy's played for Feyenoord. I'm putting him in embarrassing. Yeah, that's. But he's he's up there with the, agree, one yeah. of the worst players I've seen. He's, I think he played five league games. I think he scored a goal. It might be unfair on five league games, but. I'll tell you what, if I had one leg, I'd run faster than him. <laughs> <laughs> it was yeah. absolutely shocking. Like, yeah. No, I agree. He's gone. Like, He's an embarrassing straight away. Who go next? Bartos. Oh, that's tough. Yeah, no, this one's tough because he's obviously, he's up there. I'd say he's borderline, borderline club legend. Would you? So what are, you, what are we putting him in? I don't think we can put him in club legend. No, he's so borderline. It hurts to put him in good though, doesn't it? I, no, we're going to have to put him in, but good, he's not a club legend. No. He didn't stay for long enough. No, good. I mean, yeah. some of the saves and that. I've said it before, I, I would have... I would put him level with Schmeichel. Because Schmeichel, we walked the league that year. Yeah. Bartos made him some unreal stops. Yeah. Schmeichel's uh, record was pretty impressive, though. I think oh, yeah. 23 clean sheets in the season. That's, that's unbelievable. That. It is, but... Um, Bartos goes into good <clears throat> oh this next one's tough Curtis Thompson for knots yeah I don't know you, I feel harsh giving him a low one but he's never really given a fair shot I don't think you know? I'm going to put him in average yeah 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 I think that's fair average now he's running it in top of the table Wickham in league one like there, I, there was potential then I think a lot of fans saw the potential but he just never got a chance it's just the managers isn't it because it's, it's just football's a game of opinion isn't it so if, if the manager that's there at the time doesn't believe him you know maybe it's just clicked at Wickham and if it was to go to a different team it won't work but yeah we'll put him in average um, for knots definitely next one Neil Bishop club legend you, sure. could, you could say he's, well he was up there with one of the moments of the decade Scoring that header against City. Mm. We're going 1 0 up. Was that this decade? Yeah, it was it. Well, yeah. So, yeah, club legend. That one's easy for me. 
Yeah, I'll agree with you. He's joining Mike Edwards in that club legend spot. Will patch him. Um, Terrible. Yeah. Now, he's another player that we sign in. He's exciting. Like, he's come from Man City. Like, cream of the crop. But I know a Twitter account that's not going to like that one, putting him in terrible. But, yeah. Um, but <laughs> he's, he's been doing absolutely nothing. Um, and I've heard a few things about potential laziness around the club especially when he was playing as well um, not given a massive opportunity but you need to you need to prove yourself and give yourself these opportunities you know what I mean so he's, he's, he's our first in our terrible slot right we'll patch in George who have we got next Richard Duffy Ooh. I, I I mean don't get me wrong I think there's there's times where he's a good player for not but I just didn't like the way he carried himself last season like just getting on to everyone like fair enough he's probably frustrated in a team that are playing poor but like just getting on to everyone like that just I remember doesn't him help. screaming at Bird one game yeah like he, he, the youngsters of the team like you don't do that you're supposed to spur him on not knock him down but then he did have those points this season where he was very good like and not just last season I'm going to say average I'm going to say terrible really yeah I think he should we agree on terrible oh I was just giving him a bit better because of how he started. Yeah, I think terrible. I think terrible. I think he goes into terrible slot. I don't think many fans liked him. He wasn't a likable character. No. When I think, when I get him in my head, and I agree with you, I get him in my head. I just see a man shouting. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like yeah. I don't see, like like if I saw Ben, ben Davis, I get a free kick. If I see Stead, I see him getting climbed on by a centre back and not getting a free kick. <laughs> yeah. I see him shouting like, yeah, yeah. like terrible. Okay. Oh, Jonathan Fort. That name gives me heartbreak. What a player! Yeah, like the only reason it gives me heartbreak is because in the playoffs the offside goal. Like, what could have been if that that would have went in? It could have spurs uh, on, but could have been a club legend. Could have been a club legend, but could've you just, just got to bang him in good, don't you? I think seeing him at Wembley scoring a winner to take knots up. Sorry. He's he's finished now, isn't he? Careers are gone. He got an injury, and he's he's got something like no, his bones are just rubbing together now. There's no, nothing in between. Nasty. What a player! What you know? What he was. Not giving enough credit for how quick he was. No, yeah, he, he's a class player. Yeah, uh, um, yeah, he's got to go in good. I think if his offside goal is rightly given, and he takes us to Wembley and we score, oh, yeah, he would have been in club legend. But I like Jonathan Fort, great player, so we'll put him in good. George Grant. This one's debatable for me. I'm gonna because you know, do you know, we just mentioned the playoffs. Like he, for me personally, he's nowhere to be seen. Anonymous. The big occasion, he didn't step up. This is going to upset, especially with it being on TV. Mm. He needed to step up for me and prove himself, and maybe even get himself a bit of interest. And he just didn't. I'm going to say something here. It might be might upset a few people. I think George Grant goes in average because other than score, if you watch him, I had this last like when he was playing for Notts. If you watched him when he didn't score, he did nothing. And yes, his goals were big in games, like some really big goals, like last minute winners and things, but he didn't do anything in games, like when he didn't score. And there was a point in. in like lazy off the ball, kind of. Yeah, yeah. There was yeah. a point in one of the seasons where he went like seven or eight games without scoring, yeah. and he did nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he goes an average for me. Okay, fair enough. You agree? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Who's next? George Grant? Christian Pierce. Straight away average. Uh, you know what? I. I can't put him in good because he wasn't unbelievable. Yeah, but he was. He was always like he gave an average performance. He did, never really let let the team down. He was more of an like like your six out of ten. You yeah, know what I mean? yeah, I, yeah. Kind of yeah, kind of like the Rawlinson. So mm. he's just giving you that constant average performance. Yeah, I don't think he can go into good quite. No. Um. Yeah. Terry Hawkridge. I don't know. What do you reckon? That's kind of tough, isn't it? Because I think Knotts is quite close to his heart, isn't it? Terrible. Really? <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Oh, I, I didn't ever see him beat a man. He's a winger that doesn't beat a man. Yeah, yeah. No, I, it's yeah. just I feel like it's quite harsh, but I he came in and I think we also signed Alessandra, didn't we, at the same time from yeah. Hartlepool? Yeah. Alessandro was the better player. Yeah. Um, 
no doubt. <clears throat> Should still have Louis Alessandro now, I think. But um, Terry Hawkridge did absolutely nothing. Yeah, every time he, he was on the wing and he got the ball, I thought to myself, nothing's happened here. Mm. Didn't happen. Yeah. Uh, no, I'd agree with that. So terrible. Whole heart leader. Have we got one and embarrassing, and it's Sivard Sprockle? I mean, you've got to be pretty poor to be level with him. But, yeah. yeah. Right, after Hawkridge, we've got Matt Tootle. Do you want to start? I'm going to put Tootle in good. No. Didn't step up last season. That's last season. Doesn't matter. That's I think a, he's been a full season. I think he's been a, no, no, no. a he's good, good player. He's, no, don't club. get me wrong. He's a good player. Like, great player. I do. He's a very likeable character. But last season... Oh, I'm struggling with this one. He, he know he knows it as well because he he put it on Twitter like at the end of last season that he wants to uh, prove himself like right the wrongs and okay and that sort of stuff. Like mm. don't get me wrong, I like Matt Tuttle, but for me last season, yeah, think about that season where Notts got to the playoffs. Yeah, think about last season. He was when class. We relegated. Everyone was bad. <laughs> Everyone was woeful. Oh, no, come on, a couple of individual performances can lift the team and well, not from right back. What are you gonna do? Turn into it don't matter. Yeah, you can. Turn Mate, you start Catherine. playing well. Yeah, but you egg over on Spur and else. I know you when you're playing well. Putting oh, him in good. All right, putting him in average. We'll go average. If, yeah, okay. Right, next one. Lee Hughes. Club legend. Club legend. Should have seen the reception at Solihull when he was in the stands. <laughs> Absolutely getting mobbed. Yeah. It's people slapping him on the head and everything. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's, if that's not, if that doesn't scream club legend, what, what does? Nothing. I mean, he's 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 a man that's slapping him on the head. Yeah, is he all right? <laughs> he was fine. He was loving it. <laughs> he was welling. Um, yeah, club legend. He's how many goals did he score? I mean, he didn't end that well. I mean, we're talking about we're not just talking about how they how these players played. Obviously, he wasn't that good at the start of this decade. He was better at the end of the last decade. Yeah, but it's it, it's because he played for Notts in this decade. So. Um, Club legend. Club legend. He joins Mike Edwards. Always got you up, Lanton, then he leaves. Never. Always. Never. Always. Always. Uh, Shodan Miobi. Last one. Ooh. See, I quite liked him, you know. I think he, he could board a club legend, yeah. If we said Bartos board a club legend. Yeah, no, he's definitely, he, he's up there, isn't he? Ooh. You can't, I don't think you can put him in club legend. But not to have had Shodan Miobi. The guy scored at the new Camp, I think. For Newcastle, the guy scored at the new Camp, and then he's. Um, <sighs> Say it. Say it club, le- club legend. We've got, we've got like, is he going to be in the same bracket as people like Les Brad, and Lee Hughes and Mike Edwards? You said it. No, I don't think he can. Yeah, but, yeah, but it's Sean Ramiobi playing for Knots. Don't matter. It's not. It's not the, the name, guys, is it? Look at Sol Campbell. If, if we had Saul Campbell on this list, if he was in this decade, I'm putting, so right, putting him in embarrassing. He played for about 15 minutes. Yeah, but Sherlock maybe didn't play for 15 minutes. Yeah, I know, but he, he didn't play. <laughs> He's not the Sherlock Ramiobi that was at the new camp, is he? <laughs> I think you've just got to put He is the goal. same man, though, isn't he? <laughs> it is, the same, is it the same Sherlock Ramiobi that played the new was camp? Was it the same player? Yeah, it is. No, it's not, though. It's, Technically, it's, it's an same, aged player. Like, no. Is it the same what? man? It's the same person. So it's the same person. Oh, yeah. that's what I just said. <laughs> or put him in good. Put him in good. Put yeah. Amiobi in good. Um, no, nah, I like doing that. That was good. There's there's so many more players we could have put in there. I mean, just random selection. Right? Yeah, just a random selection from the past past ten years. Well, obviously, people are going to disagree with a lot of these. I think a lot of disagree with George, George Grant. Grant. Um, I hope no one disagrees with Sprockle. Yeah. Because yeah, he's a terrible player. Um, but yeah, happy New Year. Uh, thank you for watching our videos throughout the last year um, and if you agree or disagree leave a comment in the comment section below